Welcome to Media Exported, a channel where I show you different video editing tricks and techniques that will take your skills to the next level. In this video, I will show you how to create this whip pan transition in Premiere Pro. Before we begin, please subscribe if you want to see more tutorials like this one. With your clips ready, the first thing you need to do is go to the project panel and add an adjustment layer. Expand this, click on the adjustment layer and click OK. Now drag your new layer to the timeline where you want to create the transition. Drag the playhead over the cut between the two clips. From this point, move five frames to the left by clicking the left arrow five times and crop the adjustment layer to this frame. Do the same thing on the right side. Now that you have this layer ready, you can start adding the necessary effects. Go to the Effects panel and search for Offset. Then drag it onto the Adjustment layer. You will also need Gaussian Blur for this effect, so add it too. Now you need to animate these effects. Go to Effect Controls and find the offset and blur effects that you added. Make sure that the playhead is at the start of a clip and click the icons for the Blurriness and Shift Center 2 effects. This will enable keyframing for those controls. Now drag the playhead to the end and add new keyframes by clicking these dots. For this keyframe, you need to change the offset by the resolution of your sequence so that the clip will make a full cycle and look the same as before. In this example, my sequence width is 1920, so I had to subtract 1920 from 960, which equals minus 960. Now drag the playhead to the middle and add a keyframe for blurriness. Set this value to whatever fits your needs. Don't forget to change blur dimensions and check this box. The last thing you need to do is select all keyframes, right click on them and enable Ease In and Ease Out. Please subscribe if you learned something. Unfortunately, that's all for this video. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.